Okay, so this is going to be the wonderful tale of how I stole a bicycle in the 7th grade. School starts at 8.45. I wake up at 8.45. And then I rush my little self to get ready. And then run out the door. And my mom's like, I'm not dropping you off because you're late. And I'm not going to encourage you to be late. So I'm going to make it more difficult for you. Which, okay. Running out the door. Running through my neighborhood. And then there's like a park between like... The other houses in my neighborhood and then you don't need to go through the park to go to the school you can just follow the sidewalk near the main road and then go through the underpass and then walk to the school but apparently i was stupid that day and decided hey let me take the longest way possible thinking it's a shortcut because i haven't done it yet and then i'm walking through and i'm like huh there's a bike in the ditch i wonder why the bike's in the ditch and then i see like a blood stain on a wall like, it, it's not really a wall, it's more like a soundproof barrier to a highway that's like 20 feet below that wall, but uh, I, I don't know, there was a dent in the wall, there might have been a hole, but there was a blood stain and a bike there. So I, I, I went there and I, I got the bike, and I'm like, okay, tires are working, steering's working, it, uh, the, the pedals are working, uh, this seems like a perfectly intact bike, don't know where the guy who road it is might be dead might be in the highway you never know so i go get the bike start riding the bike and i'm like wow this is this bike is going real fast and then i realized it's not really like one of those normal bikes it's it's like one of those like french racing bikes that, with the really thin tires and the really like weird curvy handle i'll probably like put an image across the screen right there okay and then you just get on the bike and i was just running as fast as i can i'm like i'm gonna make it in time i'm gonna make it in time i'm gonna make it in time and then i'm like going down this underpass of the bridge so like it's a kind of like a concave shape, so I'm like speeding up all the way down, get up, picked up a whole bunch of speed, and then like flew through the other end of that bridge, and then just kept going and going and going. And then like I got to the point where the school, but my school doesn't have a normal entrance. It's like, um, like basically like three feet up of stairs, but the entire staircase is like 12 feet wide. So the like, I would have to slow down, get off the bike, and probably just stash it somewhere behind the school because I didn't have a like, well, a like a lock because it's not my bike but here's the point where i realized the bike had no brakes and i am going full speed towards the staircase and i could veer the bike to the other direction but that's into the middle of the road with several cars so i'm probably screwed and there's also a tree there so i'm probably screwed and there's people there so i'm probably screwed so i do what any sane person would do i see that trash can beside the thing i aim the bike at the trash can I jump off to the side of the bike, tuck and roll, and then just fall over and tumble. Then I'm like, wow, I'm totally fine. And then I see the freaking bike going full speed, freaking hits the trash can, like, dents the trash can. Like, the trash can wrapped around the freaking tire, like, cut it in half. And then I got up, everyone's like, the fuck just happened? And I'm like, I'm gonna ignore this. I'm gonna pretend this never happened. And then I just walked up, went home. <laughs> Went to school. I, that would be kind of pointless because the whole thing was to go to school. Okay, I, I I went to school, went on my day, and then I heard the principal call the announcements. I was just like, um, uh, so there was a bike and it's lodged in the trash can in front of the school. If you know anything about it, please come to the office. And I'm like, I'm gonna pretend that's not me. And then my friend, she knew, she knew. She looked me right in the eyes. She's just like, nigga, you 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 crashed that trash can. And I'm like, I I did, I did. I got, and then you know what? When I came back there, saw another kid. He, he picked up the bike. I could have warned them, but I just I just let him take it. Cause it's, it's the cycle of the bike. Some say people who have entered the cycle are cyclists. Fuck, that was an awful joke. Okay, so yeah, that that that's my wonderful tale of black man stealing bike. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful video. And, uh, leave a like so I can afford a pizza.